it's tomorrow. Um, we're in the hotel, and Chris is in the shower, and Joe's in bed, and Mark's in bed. Hey, is this your video documentary? Yeah. Oh, uh, no, the video documentaries. No, it's not in the man. It's 6.30. No, it's 10.2. We woke up at 6.30. Well, I did. I had a shower already. Now Chris is in the shower. Say hello! What? Say hello! Hi! Yay! Okay, what's on the agenda for today, Chris? Well, we're going to visit a waterfall and this big rift in the earth called the Rift. Which is actually just the Eurasian plates and North Atlantic plates. Hey, look, your, there's two of them. <laughs> your hat's like you just bring your case to that side. That and side. Clear this space. Okie dokie, Steve. So, Steve, what are we doing today? We are going up to the Thermal Spring. Really? Yes, we are. Hmm, then what? Uh, we are then going whaling. 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 Good. Unfortunately, we're not allowed <laughs> to eat whale meat. Hearing. Uh, had risen from 75 centimetres to 104 Whoa. Uh, Damn. in the night, which is quite a bit, and they didn't know what was happening. But now they found out, realised that uh, the eruption started under the main main ice cap, area of Yatla And we're going to drive from Reykjavik up uh, to a little town called Borkenes. We go through the tunnel, which is under the fjord. Going to look at the waterfalls and the hot spring pass up to the National Park and the Rift Valley. Woohoo! Wow. What's that about 900 feet, did you say? 900 meters? That is huge. You can tell Chris is excited about the whole thing. This winter has been very unusual for us. Uh, there should be hardly any snow. Look at that, Chris. Snow, uh, just uh, around Christmas time. And then in February, for 20, sometimes we have... Uh, this is the Icelandic Christmas myth. Of a woman who uh, children in a bag and eats them. Some people can go out and... Merry Christmas. <laughs> oh, we're in a tunnel. I'm never going to and we're out of the tunnel. Oh, that's bright. Oh, I can feel the warmth oh, of the sun. Like, good God. It's very bright, look at that. I won't even focus. Well, everyone's whacking out the sunglasses now. I actually need them, I mean. Alright, Chris, having fun? That's where we just came from. We just drove under that large expanse of water. Oh, nice. Under the mountain and under the water. And up we went. Oh, fantastic. Yes. Oh, I was freaking we excited. Did we get to see, like. Brian, I'm not backing up, bloody. This is what we came to see. Basically, there's been a huge eruption on the other side of the country, basically, but um, underneath the glacier, and we're going to go see it. Now, it wasn't Katla, not now, tomorrow. It wasn't Katla, but it was a big eruption. It's a serious eruption, and we're going to go see it. But we're not allowed to bring home because you'll worry. Now we're going to see the hot spring. Where are we? We're in a in a uh, hot spring place. There's all kinds of hot spring and ting. Oh, it's cold! Look at that view. That is something. Check it out. Well, that's my picture done today. Looking forward to hot tub. Oh, is that tonight? Yeah, yeah, we got hot tubs tonight. Oh, and it's so good, yeah. fantastic. And then tomorrow night we have hot tubs in the room. Sweet. Woo! Iceland is good. Then afterwards we're going to have to... Well, Steve said to be careful, so naturally we're walking to the edge of the cliff. It's the biggest tree I've ever seen in Iceland. It's about two and a half metres high. Now, you should probably be careful. Uh, they're not allowed. Aww. Oh yeah, no people. Why build a pathway? Oh, that's where all the cool people are going. Up there. Jesus! Wow. <laughs> Look at it meandering through there. Mark, opinions of this spectacular wonder of nature? It's pretty spectacular. That's it all I can really say. 
It is absolutely incredible. Incredible. <laughs> that was awesome. Uh, the wind picked up slightly and it rained and we got very wet and cold and hailstones and it was fun. It was? Yeah. They've actually breached the main road. Breaking news. What is it? Six. Oh, 15 on top of your ready 46. The eruptions got much worse and now they breach the main roads. So basically, the itinerary is, is will have to be cancelled. We'll have to switch things round. But we're working on it. The bio morning is still the same. We can still see the old we can still see the geysers and the hot springs and all that sort of stuff. Oh, my God. We'll still be able to see a glacier. Ah. <laughs> and hopefully, my camera will be able to focus by then.